We're gonna get hung up in the trees. custom made fishing rod from somebody who streams here on Twitch like the rod we have here as you can see it has our name on it handmade burl wood handles got the Paratopia logo on it super sexy location super sexy rod right there if you want a custom made rod like that right there Check out Wolfram Custom Rods. Uh, Wolfram. There's a link to his website. Make sure you check him out, guys. Super awesome fishing rod right there. I love it. All right, let's uh, switch over baits like we were gonna do. <laughs> Yeah, anything your heart desires. Uh, I think my phone died over here. Not in. There we go. Wish my bro would watch this. Oh, <laughs> uh, you're having one built? Sweet, man. I'll have to try to check it out. I don't hardly get any time to watch anybody. Oh, shoot. I just dropped my rod in the water. Turn my reel. Alright, as far as the lures we're using, guys. There they are. Euro Tackle Micro Finesse. They specialize in Micro Finesse lures. If you want to get into creek fishing, go to EuroTackle.net and buy you some of their micro fishing stuff. Uh, this is the one we're using. This is their new one. The EPF Swim. It's a one inch swim bait. <laughs> Yeah. Any snake skins or anything up here? Or any live snakes? Looks like snake territory. Looks like fish territory too. Come on, baby, let's go. Let's get it. Let's get it going for once. Oh. Hey, fish on. <laughs> Oh, yeah, here we go. Don't let it easy do to grab my leg like, I don't know if it's a catfish or what. Uh, this is fish number three, species number two. Creeks aren't aren't producing like they normally do. We had some we had some really bad floods this year. I mean they were all these creeks were washed out pretty bad. I don't know if that has anything to do with it. I don't know. Man. Trying to make up excuses, you know. Ooh, fish on. What we got? That's a large mouth. Yeah. Damn, I need a large mouth. That's a <laughs> That's my PB Stripe Shiner right there. Golly. Wow. That's a huge Stripe Shiner, dude. And they got the horns on their head. Uh, this is not a horny head. This They get these little horns when uh, spawning season comes in. 
a horny head actually has spines all the way down its body and it's got a uh, a downward facing mouth this is a stripe shiner here and a huge one at that that was my PB stripe shiner and we caught it on the Euro tackle extreme Philly fishing one inch swim bait. Yeah, that's deep. <laughs> if I didn't have waders on, I'd go right through it. But I got my waders. I can't really get up. It's shallow over here, but. Oh, shoot. It's moving. Oh, snap. Pleco, what's up? <laughs> I ain't doing good today either. I've caught like four fish. But... Uh, here we go. This is not... I don't know what's happened to the creeks, Pleco. Something turned them off, man. Can't seem to catch anything. I need to redeem myself here. Show everybody what parasitic can do, but it ain't happening. I'm showing everybody what parasitic can't do. <laughs> I, I was getting bit. Ooh, ooh. I seen that one. That was a pretty good fish. That might be one of the bass holes up here. Oh. There he is. Oh yeah. That's the bass. No, it's not. It's a huge bluegill. <laughs> a huge one. Dang, I thought that was a bass, bro. On the EPF. The EPF swim. Oh God. I'll take it. There we go. Big old guy. All right. How about that? <laughs> uh, I need some of the wet. Uh, yeah, I need some of the super chicken webbing for sure. Uh, this is the same, the same stream. Uh, just different spot, different location. Same stream though. Sounds like a new. How about that? Dang, son. <laughs> That's a lot of work for that little guy, man. Don't they crap? The sun's going down. I'm about to get going here a little bit. Whoa, whoa. Hello. <laughs> there he is. There he is. Another bluegill. He's a little smaller. A little smaller than that last one, but pretty, pretty decent size still. Pretty decent size. Got two more jars on the way. I want to get some, man. There's another one, holy shit. All right, we found them finally. Jesus, only took forever. 
It only took forever. Hey, they are slaying the, the one inch swim bait though. And it's kind of weird because the color of the swim bait that I'm using is baby bluegill. <laughs> Locked in and getting slammed. Yeah, man. Hopefully. It... Oh, there's another one. Golly, son. I wasn't ready for that one. Oh my gosh, dude. What in the world? Like an army of bluegill up here. Sorry for the sun in your eyes. It's right in my eyes, too. I can't really see where I'm casting now. Come on, baby, where's the other ones at? McKJ, you been doing all right? I can't wait to try my new uh, micro fishing rod. Oh, that's a pretty good one too, man. That is a another bluegill. Could always be worse. That's true, man. It's it's hard to think positive sometimes, man. Especially me. <laughs> I don't have anything to be. I don't have anything to be depressed about, man. But but I am quite often. But. We always got to remember that we're doing much better than we deserve. That's the way I look at it. I like the way I like to look at it anyway. I'm doing a lot better than I deserve. Frothy Donger. <laughs> What's up, man? Welcome. Welcome to the creek. The creek life. We found a good school of bluegill here, but I think it's about over, over with. I think I caught most of them. Yeah, that's not white. <laughs> Wayne, that's not right. You know, you know, nobody keeps up with that in my stream, man. We caught like uh, eight, I would say. Two different, yeah, two different species. No, three. Three species. Good to see you as always, Wayne. Yeah, we're doing pretty good.
I need to get on that Shane and Jackie level. Ooh, there's one. There's one. What oh, we got? Another big old donger bluegill, man. Holy cow, this one's massive. Look at that. Look at that beast. Shoot, yeah, man. Right on. That was a good bluegill right there. Here's what we're using. You guys are just coming in. It's a Euro Tackle. Uh, it's a 132nd ounce jig head with a 1 inch swim bait. Euro Tackle EPF swim. There's another one. Oh, come on, there, big guy. Take it. Take it. They have a dry stretch and then boom. Oh, that sounds horrible, man. Come on, little blue girl. I know there's some more over there. I need to catch a bass. A <laughs> hundred fish. That's, that's ridiculous. <laughs> All right, now what's going on? The bite turned off again. The sun dropped my eyeballs. I can't see. That's a deep hole over there, dude. Deep. Oh, yeah. I remember that place. That's a good spot, man. There's a bite. You got it? There he is. Oh, shoot. That's another striped shiner. He's not as big as the... We caught our PB striped shiner uh, at the beginning of the stream. This one's not quite as big. Shit. Oh man. You camera shot or something? Stripe shiner. Metal core, what's going on, man? Trying to catch some little creek fishies. There's another one right there getting a hit. It's been tough fishing, man. You, Creek, creek fishing usually isn't too difficult, but sometimes, man, it's just like fishing a lake. You get, oh, wow, what is this? Bluegill. Big bluegill. Oh, this one's heavier than that other one. Another good size bluegill. Alright, man. 
man. I'm loving this. Oh, shoot. I forgot. I had another one here. I'm ready to catch a bass, so there's usually uh, quite a few bass up in here. Hello from Ireland. All right. Welcome to the stream. Welcome to Paratopia, the creek life. Hey! Oh, shit, son. Who's raiding? The fishing technician. All right. Welcome, guys. Fishing technician, thank you for that raid. Make sure you follow fishing technician, please. Obviously, another fisherman on Twitch. So if you guys like fishing, give him a give him a follow. How was the stream, man? What's up, dog balls? Broder. We found this nice little hole here. We're catching. We've been catching them pretty consistently, little fishies. We're testing out the uh, Euro tackle, one inch swim bait. Uh, so far, so good. Fishing technician's birthday. All right, happy birthday, man. Nobody tonight was trying to catch creek chub or suckers. Dude, man, I don't know what it is. You're, you're obviously having the same issue I am. Uh, something about the creeks this year is just not right. They're not producing at all like they normally do. I've been catching bluegill here pretty consistently, but mm -mm, it's still nothing like it normally is for some reason. I don't know what the deal is. It's kind of weird. Kind of weird, man. Here's bite. Take it. There he is. What we got? A small bluegill. I want to catch some bass or something, man. I need a bass. I used to catch bass like crazy out of this hole. What's up? What happened? What happened to my bass hole? God, he came off. <laughs> oh, I love it, dude. I love it so much. I'm going to have to watch your... Uh, Watch your VOD, fishing technician. You're catching some, some micros. <laughs> Para would slay this bass hole. A <laughs> couple inches of snow in Boston today. Oh yeah, I heard about that. I heard about the, uh, you guys going to be getting some snow. That's crazy. Dude, these things are so finicky. It's hard to catch them on a bite. They, they've just been, like, pecking at it, man. Not committing to the, to it like they normally do. Dang, dude, that sucks. Yeah, I hope things get better for you, man. You're, you're a good fisherman. Oh, shoot. <laughs> he hit that as soon as it hit the water. I wasn't even ready. I'm going to try to make a YouTube video out of this. Again, for you guys that are just coming in, what we're using, eurotackle.net. 
they have pretty much everything you need for creek fishing. Uh, probably my favorite micro lure company. Uh, this is the one, their little one inch swim bait that they just came out with. And it's working pretty good. I'm not sponsored for them. I'm not sponsored by them. I just like their product. It'd be awesome to be, to be sponsored by them, but... <laughs> Yeah, I don't stream enough to be sponsored by anybody anymore. I don't get the chance to. Maybe one day we can dream, right? We can dream. Oh, that's a little guy. A little tiny guy. That's what was probably picking at it. Surprised that he got even got that in his mouth. Ever use a chatterbait? Oh, yeah. Oh yeah. I don't do a lot of bass fishing though, unless it's for, uh, I use a lot of micro lures. Actually, that's the main thing I use is micro lures. Uh, I do go on the river every, every once in a while and catch smallmouth bass. I don't fish lakes at all. I don't like fishing lakes. It's not a good experience for me. I can catch fish, but, uh, the issue for me is the uh the crowdedness of it i don't like you know it's just not peaceful uh this right here is what i like there's nobody else out here it's just me nature it's peaceful it's tranquil i can come out here and enjoy myself not to worry about nobody else I'm newer to the creek fishing, so I don't have any patterns to follow, but learning each time. Yeah, I mean, it's not too, it's not too difficult. I mean, it's, it's easier. It's easier than lake fishing, for sure. You just gotta find the deep pockets. Uh, and, you know, the current slack-offs, stuff like that. Uh, check out Eurotackle.net, though, man. Buy you some of their soft plastics. They do. They do amazing. Like I said, probably my favorite. Oh yeah, here we go. Probably my favorite when it comes to uh, creek fishing stuff. Euro, Eurotackle.net I don't have any discount code or anything. Like I said, I'm not sponsored by them. I just really like their stuff. I wish I could. I wish I could get you guys a discount code. That'd be sweet. But I don't have one. I apologize. I fish shoulder to shoulder, spring runs. Oh my gosh, dude! I wouldn't even do that. I'd be like, nope. Y'all can have it. <laughs> I don't know that. I don't, I don't even go to Walmart, man. I don't. I couldn't tell you the last time I've been inside an actual store. Oh, shit, it came off. Mm. I'm one of those introverts. Mm. I'm not really antisocial, though. It's just, you know, people piss me off. <laughs> <laughs> I know that's kind of surprising to you guys since uh, you know, it doesn't really seem like I get pissed off very easy, but yeah, I, I kind of do. That sun's about to fall over the trees over there, man. It's gonna get dark on us real quick. <laughs> you hear that, Negri? 
Yeah, man, I don't... I just don't do good with, with rude people, man. Or just, you know, I don't know. Is it really that hard to be a nice person? Uh, that's, that's what I think when I, when I go out in public. <laughs> But I gotta say that for the most part, people are people are pretty nice. You just get the occasional occasional bad apple. <laughs> you like zombies? <laughs> All right, man. Good luck, Pleco. Thanks for hanging out, man. Losing yourself in a moment. Absolutely, man. For sure. I got so many creeks marked on my maps that I want to check out. I just don't have the time to check out, man. So many places that we could go, <laughs> that we could go fish. I just ain't got the time to go check them out. Well, the bite's slowing down. Have we reached the end of the line? Is this it? Is the fishing really over? Back in the days we fished calming. Yeah, man, it's where you get your soul right. You get to escape from everything for a little bit. Hello. I'm getting hungry, chat. Yep, there's one. You got it? No, we don't. I thought he had it. He bit it right at the edge of that current. Oh, shoot. I don't know how deep it is over here. <laughs> oh, yeah, baby, that's deep. Um, oh, well, never mind. We got it. This is calming. <laughs> Don't y'all fall asleep now. Might catch a shark or something, you never know. Oh, shoot. There's the shark. Look at that. Look at that Tennessee spotted creek shark. Uh, just this is a stripe stripe shiner. Little old stripe.